Students in the heavy equipment career pathway at Fairdale High School are getting the most hands-on experience you could possibly get. They're building a new facility for the local fire department. Everything that you see that's on the ground right now, we all built. All, this, all the cages have been welded together. All the holes have been dug. It's all by us, all by sophomores, juniors, and seniors. The students work with construction machinery like excavators, bulldozers, and concrete mixers. I mean, this is not stuff that normal high school kids are doing. Like, this is a special program. They spent their freshman year learning how these machines operate. And this is lifelong skills that they're going to have. And Captain Blevins says the kids are a joy to work with. The ones that are in these programs, they want to be there, and they're they have goals to be somebody when they get out. So this is just the first step to getting them. And I think they benefit a lot from us and we benefit a lot from them. One way the department benefits from the students is the new training facility they're helping to build. They're gonna make container ships to simulate like they're gonna put smoke bombs through it so they can crawl through it. And we're basically just forming up concrete and make it forms so that they can put the concrete or put the containers on the onto the concrete by helping plan the build and then executing that construction plan the students will be prepared to go into the construction business as soon as they graduate and this kind of real world hands-on experience in high school walker says is one of a kind this makes me want to get up every morning and go to school there's no other class that can really teach you how to go out and be in the workforce like this class can i mean you you learn you learn so much. I mean, it's, it's all real world out here. In Fairdale, Addie Miners, WLKY News. The class will assist with other construction projects around Fairdale each year. Next year is expected to be adding new sidewalks around the facility.